You are so important to both Dante and Sonny. And to be honest, I can tell that Dante is looking for an excuse to spend more time with his dad. Why are you encouraging Michael to have contact with Sonny when you know the judge ordered him not to? Oh, I'm not. No, I'm talking like in a long-term idea. After his probation is finished, everything's done. Hopefully Michael can build a bridge between Dante and Sonny. Why do you want Dante to bond with the man who shot him? You get out tomorrow, as soon as we catch Franco, you're coming back. You know, I can't promise anything, but maybe uh, for your cooperation, the parole board will be nice to you and give you two years instead of five. Of course, if you do take off, I lose my badge and end up in prison. So you're going to be under surveillance pretty much every second that you're out of here. I'm going to need a gun. Well, that's not going to happen. Then the deal's off. Look, guys, I don't want anyone to fight about this. Brooke was just saying that maybe there's still hope for my dad and Dante. That was it. There isn't. Dante does not like Sonny. I don't think it's fair for you to put Michael in the middle of them. I'm not. They're a family, all right? I was just saying it, it would be nice if one day they were closer. Why do you want Dante to be close to the man who shot him? Okay, in my dad's defense, he just found out that Dante was an undercover cop. That's the way the business works, Lulu. I mean, he knew that going in. Yeah, which is why he didn't tell anybody in the neighborhood, because he understood how dangerous it was. And plus, he made the decision to do a major bust with no backup, and he was unarmed. I'm sorry, this does not excuse Sonny. He knew that Dante was unarmed, and he shot him anyway. Okay, you know what, Lulu? If you want to hate Sonny, go ahead. But that doesn't mean that everybody else in this world has to. I don't hate Sonny. Michael doesn't hate his father, and I just think it would be nice if maybe one day Dante didn't hate Why his father. Why do you care? Why do I care? Because Michael is my cousin, and Sonny has always been good to me. And you know what? We have the right to express a hope that maybe one day Dante will be closer to Sonny. Well, you know what? I don't want to hear it. I think Sonny is the worst thing that's happened to his kids. Whoa, that is not true. Okay, your father loves you, and you. I don't remember you being so judgmental. I don't remember inviting you in. You know what? I'm just going to leave, all right? Michael, it was great to see you, and uh, I'm really sorry if I got you in trouble with your new ma, but I'll see you around. What are you, what are you telling me? You're not going to take this deal? After what Franco did to Sam, you, you want to do, you do anything to uh, catch I'm not going to help anybody if I let Franco kill me. And for all I know, that's your plan. You shove me out there as bait, Franco kills me, you try to catch him, and you won't. By the way. But what is your plan? You want me to give you a gun, you're gonna shoot him, then take off, and then I lose my badge? No, I need, I need a gun out there. Well, hey, I watched this movie one time where, where the, the bad guy disarmed the good guy and, and also uh, killed him with, a, with nothing more than a pen. You could always try that with Franco if it comes to it. You're really suggesting I kill Franco with a pen? No, I'm not suggesting you kill Franco with a pen. I'm suggesting maybe you walk out of here in police custody. With any luck, Franco sees it, comes out of hiding, and I arrest him. Yeah, well, stopping Franco is not gonna be as easy as busting Michael. Well, actually... Maybe I got Michael put in here, but I definitely got him yeah, out of here. Yeah, now you want to catch Franco, so you're the hero, right? So everyone forgets that you're a liar. Wait, 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 do you want to be a part no, of it? I'm not walking out in front not? of a serial killer, unarmed, just to make you look good. <sighs> Wasn't I? Uh, maybe you were a little overboard, yeah. Brooke just, she doesn't understand who Sonny is, so don't let her talk you into stuff. She doesn't have to. He's my dad and I love him. That's okay. That's okay. You just shouldn't want to be like him. That's why the judge has you living here with Dante, so you can see a better life up close. Look, I'm... I'm sorry. I really shouldn't have trashed Sonny in front of you. No, I trash away. It's not going to change the way I feel about him. And besides, why do you care if he's close to Dante? I mean, I'm the one who should be jealous of anything. It... Sonny believes that he's above the law and that he can do whatever he wants, and Dante's the opposite. He, he believes in the law. He, he trusts the system, even though it's flawed, and he's a very good cop. If he gets close to Sonny, Sonny will take advantage. You don't give Dante much credit, do you? I... I know Sonny. Anyone who gets close to him gets hurt. You're afraid Dante will turn out to be like my dad? No, that's... No, it's not, that's not... Look, if it makes you feel better, Dante knows exactly what he believes in. I do not see him compromising at all to be close to my dad. Mm -hmm. I hope you're right. But my dad loves Dante, and I do not see that changing. Are you okay with that? <laughs> you know, there's nothing really I can do about it, so... 
I gotta, I gotta do something. Um, if Dante comes back, just uh, tell him I'll be back. I'll keep you covered at all times. So you're gonna keep a gun on me and bust Franco at the yeah, same time? Yeah, I'm pretty good multitasker. Franco wants me. I can stop him, why not just let me? So you're gonna kill him and then turn the gun on me? No. You're gonna have to trust me, just like uh -huh. you're asking me to trust I, you. I don't trust you, that's where the problem's gonna be. You don't understand how Franco thinks. We're not talking about a brilliant strategist here. We're talking about a sick person who kills people. I can see that. That's why I have the advantage over you in this situation. That's why I'm gonna catch him when you haven't. Okay. Just don't underestimate him. Just be the bait. Franco shows up, I'll take over from there. It's not gonna work. I'll be back tomorrow. Next time we were here, is it Michael? Is it Dante right? They're fine. Um, you probably know everything I'm about to say, but Franco has resurfaced, and Dante convinced Claire Walsh to let him use Jason as bait to catch him. J Jason's out of prison? Yeah, he's gonna be in Dante's custody, which means if Jason makes a run for it, Dante could lose his badge. He could even end up in prison. What do you want? I'm asking you to make sure that Jason doesn't escape. I'm doing this for Dante. He he, he would never ask me to do this. He doesn't even know that I'm here. Well, uh, you're assuming that uh, Dante losing his badge is a, is a bad thing. If Dante loses his badge, he will lose a part of himself, and I'm asking you not to let that happen. I, I'm pretty sure I can keep Jason from running. Thank you. Well, you know, it's not going to be like before where I supported you because your dad was a great friend of mine, and we, we had history together lately. You've been kind of treating me a certain way. So, if I'm gonna do something for you, I need something back. What do you want? If I keep Jason from running, will you stop talking me down to my kids? Even Dante?